Hi everybody, just wanted to give you a quick review on the uh, the mag flip, which has a uh, scrubber on one side and a blade holder on the other. I uh, picked this up, this is for 3 8 glass, or below it's called a mag flip medium. I picked it up on, it was on sale at mops.ca for like 26 bucks, so I couldn't resist it. But when I brought it home, I thought I was missing the blade. Turns out the blade for glass is this uh, plastic piece right here. And uh, and what I thought I saw was uh, replacement blades was actually uh, black blade black plastic blades for acrylic. So what I figured out is have that regular razor blade here. There was uh, two tabs I kind of lock onto here. I pop those off and I just stick uh, one of my disposable razor blades in here and I make sure this is uh, looking quite straight right here you'll see if it doesn't cut if it doesn't cut straight you know you're not level right here so I just pop that in and uh, believe it or not this medium works quite well on my um, half, inch half inch thick glass aquarium now if I was trying to scrub with this it might not work but the razor blade needing little pressure I managed quite well so I'll show you how it works right now on Coraline. So here we have some Coraline. I'm just gonna pop this guy into the water and like I mentioned this is half inch thick glass so this is the wrong size for my tank but uh, as you'll see right here you can do little uh, jerks on it and it still does a good enough job. So, I'm sure if I had a stronger one, I wouldn't have to uh, wiggle it around as much, but uh, Mops got a shipment of these medium ones because he got a good deal on it, so he passed a good deal on to his customers, so 26 bucks I couldn't resist. Because I do have smaller tanks anyway, so I figured there won't be any loss if it didn't work, so you can see does a pretty good job. This is Coraline you can't even see through. Oh. So, for 26 bucks it does the job pretty good. I'm happy with it, even though I had to mod it a bit. And now that I got this, my front glass probably won't grow as bad, because I, I used to stick my arms in there, or I had a... Uh, Get who makes it. I had that one blade on a handle thingy. That didn't always. Not having a replaceable blade like these disposables, the blade's never as sharp as you'd like it to be. Now, this mag, it's called a mag flip too because you're able to flip it underwater. I'll show you how that's done. Um, when you do flip it around, they. they, uh, they uh, tell you to have the blade facing down because the. This doesn't float like a mag float does. It actually sinks. And if you let go, it's gonna this the bottom's gonna be heavier than the top. So it's gonna flip on you already. So what you do is you you pull this guy out at about I don't know a couple inches here. You can see it's see it's still holding it on the glass. If I pull away too much, you'll see it starts to sink. And then you give it a quick flip and put it on the glass, and there you go, I've just flipped it. And then you can do your scrubbing with that piece here. And mind you, the instructions weren't that great on this. I don't know. I got to read it a couple times before I figured it out. And then when you're ready to flip it again, I got the blade facing down. You pull it away to just before it starts to sink. You have to turn it quick. See, that didn't work. Let me try this again. So you pull it away. You have to flip it. <laughs> I made it look good the first time, didn't I? Anyways, take some practice, and there you go.